Antarctica, a continent shrouded in ice and mystery, where the landscape is as harsh as it is beautiful. At the heart of this icy wilderness lies Marie Birdland, Earth's largest unclaimed territory, a place of endless white. This vast expanse of glaciers, mountains and frozen plains remains largely unexplored, a true frontier in every sense. Its remoteness and harsh climate have long posed significant challenges to even the most intrepid explorers, testing their limits. No nation can lay claim to this frozen kingdom, leaving it as a testament to international cooperation and scientific endeavor, a symbol of unity. Researchers from around the globe study the planet's climate, geology, and unique ecosystems here, seeking answers to global questions. The mysteries of Marie Birdland beckon, holding secrets yet to be uncovered, inviting the curious and the brave. The history of exploration in Marie Birdland is a testament to human curiosity and resilience. This remote and icy expanse has long captivated the imaginations of adventurers and scientists alike. The first recorded sighting of this remote region came in 1929 during Richard E. Byrd's pioneering flight over the South Pole. His daring journey marked a significant milestone in the annals of polar exploration. Byrd named the region in honor of his wife, Marie, cementing her name in the annals of polar exploration. This act of dedication highlighted the personal connections that often drive great feats of discovery. In the decades that followed, explorers braved treacherous conditions to map its frozen wastes. They faced relentless snowstorms, extreme cold and isolation, yet their determination never wavered. These early expeditions collected valuable data on the region's geology, climate and wildlife. Their findings laid the groundwork for future scientific research and understanding of this icy frontier. One significant expedition was led by American explorer Paul Seepel in the 1930s. Seepel's work was instrumental in advancing our knowledge of the Antarctic environment. Seepel and his team conducted extensive surveys, mapping its mountain ranges, glaciers and ice shelves. Their meticulous efforts provided invaluable insights into the continent's vast and uncharted territories. Today, Marie Birdland is a hub for scientific research. Scientists brave harsh conditions to unlock the secrets within this frozen realm. Their work provides invaluable insights into the Earth's past, present and future. One primary focus is the study of climate change. The region's vast ice sheets hold a detailed record of Earth's climate history. By drilling deep into these ice sheets, scientists can reconstruct past temperatures and greenhouse gas concentrations. Additionally, the Transantarctic Mountains offer a window into the Earth's deep past. Section 4. Geography and Geology. A land of ice and fire. Marie Birdland is a land of dramatic contrasts where towering mountains pierce the sky, creating a breathtaking and almost otherworldly landscape. Here, vast glaciers flow towards the sea, carving out valleys and shaping the land as they move. The region's geography is dominated by the West Antarctic Ice Sheet, one of the largest on Earth, covering an area of over two million square kilometers. Beneath the ice, Marie Bird Land is a land of hidden mountains, valleys and volcanoes, a mysterious world that remains largely unexplored. The Transantarctic Mountains run along the western edge, their jagged peaks rising above the ice, forming a natural barrier that divides East and West Antarctica. Volcanoes, both active and dormant, dot the landscape, a testament to the region's fiery geological past, with some still showing signs of activity. Mount Sidley, the highest volcano in Antarctica, rises to over 14,000 feet above sea level, standing as a silent sentinel over this frozen land. Section 5. The challenges of exploration, a harsh and unforgiving environment. Exploring Marie Birdland is not for the faint of heart. The region's remote location, extreme cold and unpredictable weather pose significant challenges. Temperatures can plummet to minus 80 degrees Fahrenheit and howling winds can create blinding whiteouts. Most expeditions rely on aircraft to reach the region. And once on the ground, researchers must transport supplies across vast distances. Crevasses hidden beneath the snow pose a constant threat. Despite the challenges, the allure of Marie Birdland remains strong for scientists and explorers. 
Section 6. The Future of Marie Birdland. Conservation and Continued Research. As we move further into the 21st century, the future of Marie Birdland hangs in the balance. Climate change is already having a profound impact on Antarctica. The region's glaciers are melting at an alarming rate, contributing to rising sea levels. The international community must act now to protect Marie Birdland and the rest of Antarctica. Reducing greenhouse gas emissions and promoting sustainable practices are essential steps in this effort. Despite the challenges, there is hope for Marie Birdland. Continued scientific research is essential to understanding climate change and developing effective mitigation strategies. International agreements, such as the Antarctic Treaty System, ensure that this unique continent remains a place for peace and scientific discovery.